Many of the sounds that dogs hit are found in our homes, some we even carry on our person. This is why Animal Wise explains what are the most annoying odours for canines. Doing so will help improve your canine friend's quality of life. Citrus. To our dog, this smell is so intense it can cause irritation in the respiratory tract. Remember that they have a sense of smell 40 times more developed than our own. Dogs hate the fragrance of citrus fruits themselves, but essential oils derived from citrus are even more offensive. Oils are concentrated products that emit a much more intense scent than the fruit itself. For this reason, the animal perceives an odour even stronger than that of food. Discover in the video that we share here which fruits are suitable for dogs. Vinegar. The aroma which this product gives off is so strong that it is unbearable for dogs. However, apple cider vinegar can provide certain benefits. We need to learn how to use it properly so that it does not provide negative experiences for our dogs. It can be used in small amounts to prevent the dog from smelling. We need to mix it into their usual shampoo to do so, otherwise it will be too pungent. We should not apply the solution to the head area and rinsing well is vital. You can use vinegar to prevent other dogs from urinating in the front of your house something which can be effective, but won't cause the dog any direct harm. Alcohol in all forms. Dogs cannot tolerate antiseptic alcohol, so applying it to their skin is strongly discouraged. In case of injury, it's best to clean it with water and go to the vet. On the other hand, alcoholic beverages are generally unpleasant for them, especially those with a higher alcohol content. Nail polish. Dogs hate this smell. Being made up of such a high number of chemical compounds, their fragrance causes sneezing and itching in their nose. In addition, nail polish remover solutions also give off a very unpleasant smell to them. Acetone is one that seems to bother them the most. Therefore, we recommend using nail polish remover without acetone and applying all these products away from dogs. Cleaning products. Dogs hate the smell of almost any cleaning product. Both chlorine and ammonia are products that give off strong odors and are highly harmful to them. Inhaling them directly can irritate the respiratory tract and esophagus. Ammonia produces an aroma very similar to that given off in urine. They may relate it to the presence of another animal in the home and remain in a state of alert. We recommend cleaning the home while another member of the family takes the dog for a walk. This will avoid turning this task into an unpleasant experience for your pet. Chile. Whether in flakes, a sauce or whole fruit, chili peppers owe their heat to a series of natural chemical compounds called capsaicinoids. This composition produces a very unpleasant odour for dogs. Smelling this food directly can cause irritation to the respiratory tract, an itchy nose and constant sneezing. We must never give them chili. Here we share a video in which we talk about other harmful foods for dogs. Mothballs. Naphthalene is often used as a pesticide because of its toxicity to insects. The ingestion of a single ball can seriously damage a dog's liver and central nervous system, leading to vomiting, diarrhea and seizures. Consuming more than one can lead to death. Therefore, it's essential to keep your dog away from this product. Perfumes Dogs hate the smell of perfumes because they are made with countless chemical compounds. While we love to add a different scent to our skin, dogs often do not like it. This is because it acts as a substitute for our natural body odour. Remember that dogs recognise us by our smell. Masking it with a different one can cause difficulty when identifying us. We should also avoid perfume for dogs. If they are made by reputable producers, they shouldn't be harmful and they can be used in moderation. However, some guardians can use them too much and there are better ways to reduce their odour. If a groomer uses their own, it should be okay. Are there any smells your dog hates? If so, leave us a comment below and tell us all about them. We'll see you next time.